Hey there, science fans. Are you ready to dive into the world of renewable energy? Let's talk about wind power, a fantastic source of clean energy that is transforming the way we think about electricity. Wind turbines capture the kinetic energy of wind and convert it into electricity. These towering structures are engineering marvels. It's like magic, but it's science. The blades spin, turning kinetic energy into mechanical power. This process is environmentally friendly, producing no harmful emissions. It's a clean, green solution for our energy needs. Plus, wind is a renewable resource, meaning it won't run out like fossil fuels. We can rely on it for generations to come. We can use wind power to create a cleaner, more sustainable future. Imagine entire communities powered by the wind. Wind power is already making a big difference, helping to reduce our reliance on fossil fuels and lowering our carbon footprint. Imagine a world powered by the very air we breathe. It's a vision that's becoming a reality. With wind power, we can reduce air pollution and combat climate change. Cleaner air means healthier lives. It's a win-win situation for our planet and future generations. Our children will thank us for the cleaner world we leave behind. So, let's harness the power of the wind and create a brighter, cleaner tomorrow. Together, we can make a difference. Now let's dive into the exciting world of hydrogen production using wind power. Electrolysis is the key process here. It's like using electricity to split water molecules, H2O, into hydrogen, H2, and oxygen, O2. Think of it like this. Wind turbines capture wind energy and convert it into electricity. This electricity then powers the electrolysis process. Inside an electrolyzer, electricity flows through water, breaking the bonds between hydrogen and oxygen atoms. The result? Pure hydrogen gas, ready to be stored and used as a clean fuel source. When it comes to wind farms, we have two main options, onshore and offshore. Each type has its own unique set of characteristics and benefits. Onshore wind farms are built on land, often in open fields or hilly areas. They are more accessible and can be integrated into existing landscapes. Offshore wind farms, as the name suggests, are located out at sea, harnessing the power of strong ocean winds. These winds are typically more reliable and powerful. Both have their pros and cons, which need to be carefully weighed. Onshore wind farms are generally cheaper and easier to build and maintain, making them a popular choice for many regions. However, they can face challenges related to land availability and visual impact, sometimes leading to public opposition. Offshore wind farms, while more expensive to install, offer access to stronger, more consistent winds, which can generate more electricity over time. Plus, they have minimal visual impact on land, preserving the natural landscape and reducing noise pollution. The choice between onshore and offshore depends on factors like wind resources, geography, and economic considerations. Each project must be evaluated on a case-by-case -case basis to determine the best approach. Many countries and companies are leading the charge in wind-to-hydrogen technology. Denmark, Germany and the Netherlands are pioneers in wind energy. They're investing heavily in research and development to advance hydrogen production from wind power. Companies like Orsted, Siemens Energy and Vestas are major players in the wind energy sector. They're developing innovative solutions for integrating wind power with hydrogen production. These companies are driving the transition towards a cleaner, more sustainable energy future. Their efforts are paving the way for a global hydrogen economy. Electrolyzers are the heart of wind-to-hydrogen systems. Two main types of electrolyzers are used, PM, or proton exchange membrane, and alkaline. Each type has its own strengths and is suited for different applications. PM electrolyzers are known for their efficiency and ability to respond quickly to changes in power supply. They're ideal for integrating with intermittent renewable energy sources like wind and solar. Alkaline electrolyzers, on the other hand, are a more mature technology with a lower upfront cost. They're well suited for large-scale hydrogen production. Wind to hydrogen technology holds immense potential for decarbonizing various sectors, offering a versatile and sustainable solution. Hydrogen produced from wind energy can be used as a clean fuel for transportation, powering not just cars but also trucks, buses and even large ships, significantly reducing emissions. In industry, hydrogen can replace fossil fuels in processes like steelmaking and ammonia production, making these traditionally high-emission industries much cleaner. It can also be used for energy storage, storing surplus wind energy for later use, ensuring a reliable and consistent energy supply. 
This technology can help reduce greenhouse gas emissions, combat climate change, and create a more sustainable energy system, benefiting both the environment and the economy. By harnessing the power of wind and hydrogen, we can create a cleaner, more sustainable future for generations to come.